In today's video, we're going to be checking out some South Park. Yeah, we're going to do the Coon Trilogy. So let's dive let's right into it. it. <laughs> like cool and friends. Oh my god. My it's crazy that he's an actual Matt, raccoon for Supergirl. True. Know why, but we're seeing a huge trend in crime. What we is to token? Source of this evil. I don't know what token is. Yes, tool shed. Tool why do we have to be called Coon and friends? <laughs> what? This is funny seeing Stan as her. Yeah. Yeah, we want to be called the Extreme Avenger League. Yeah! yeah. Extreme Avenger, Avenger League. League. I told you Tupperware. Tupperware. I know the kid in the background with the like um Mysterio. Or is that what it is? Or the question mark? I yeah. think that's Katie. I think it is. And then he I don't know if he's trying to be like more like Batman or whatever or something like that, but I think so. He, he I feel like his name is like be. Mysterio or something. Yeah, well, maybe you're wrong. Maybe. The coon is a brand people already know. Why can't it be mosquito with friends? Nobody's <laughs> mosquito? Well, mosquito. Like Ant Man, maybe? Yeah. Yeah. That's cow, I think. We need to find out what's causing the crime wave in this city. So are they trying to be like the Justice League That's or the what, Avengers or something like I that? I feel like kind of. I don't know though. Okay, um, I really enjoy having you be a part of Coon and Friends and I certainly appreciate your on-time paying of dues. He's going to fire him. It's just, I don't, I'm not getting your deal. <laughs> I mean, exactly what is Mint Berry Crunch supposed to mean? Mixed Berry Crunch? To be a part of Coon and Friends, you have to have a clear and more superhero kind of identity. I mean, you're a raccoon, bro. Right? Crunch, um, I'm just wondering if maybe you need to add something else to the mint berry crunch part of your costume. Like what? I don't like, know. He's like, like milk? Like milk? milk? <laughs> no, not like milk. <laughs> He's just cereal, though. Like, how is that a superhero? Yeah. Coon alert. alert. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. Uh -oh. oh, snaps. What's the alert, Mosquito? There's like a big fire or something in town. At least 20 people trapped inside the apartment oh, building. How the heck are they going to save these people? No I don't know how they're going to do it, but <coughs> probably they're going to do it probably. I don't know. I feel like they're going to get themselves stuck. Yeah, uh, Midbury Crunch, why don't you stay here and mind the base, okay? Why are you a little like him? Because I guess he doesn't feel like he's a real superhero. I guess not. Mom, you got to drive us downtown. <laughs> oh, it's a little late, sweetie. Why don't you boys just keep playing? He's probably going to do it, too. Mom, you're the Coons faithful butler. I want to go downtown now. Well, all right. I guess yeah, yeah. she's going to do it. Can she fit that many keys so. in her car? Wait, I just remember the oh, one's a kite. Like yeah. Here. Eric, what have we talked about with that language? One more time and I'm not taking you anywhere. Uh, I'm sorry, Ben. Can we go, please? <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. She's like, unbelievable. She, told she, Look, hey. she did, but still he doesn't learn his lesson. No. People are going to die if we don't do something. Oh, my goodness. It's a fire. Come on, Coon friends. All right, what seems to be the problem? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> this, he walked up. Uh, you know, like, like bro, he's all, like, ready to take on the charge. Yeah, boy, these firefighters uh, ain't feel like taking you serious, bro. No, I would. they're going to get in their way, Especially I feel Especially in this like. raccoon suit. <laughs> and who's this kid with the knife? Like, you know, all filled with spikes. Need help from the kid. And friends. Keep those children back, Thompson. See, hey, sir, you must let a sweetie let the nice firemen do their job. Shut up, my guy. Boy. Dang. My God, it's really him. He's uh -oh. come to help us. Captain Hindsight. Captain Hindsight. Oh, oh, yeah, I think I remember him. Captain Hindsight, the hero of the modern age. Once known as Jack Broden. So he's so supposed he's to be like Superman. Superman, pretty much. Freak accident gave him the amazing power of extraordinary hindsight. Captain Hindsight. Captain Hindsight. <laughs> Captain Hindsight, thank God you've come. What's the skinny? There's people trapped in that burning building, Captain Hindsight. You see those windows on the right side? They should have built fire escapes on those windows for the higher floors. Then people could have gotten down. And then <laughs> well, the they should have. They should have. With a more reinforced Wait, so he's not going to save them. He's looking at things they should have done. Yeah, he as give, in hindsight. Yeah, 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 he give hindsight. So how is he going to save the people right now? I don't know how he's going to oh, even save gosh. them. But, I mean, maybe he's going to do something. I hope so. But he's... Almost like a worthless superhero now. Yeah, exactly. And then you see that building to the left? Yes, they shouldn't have built that there. Because now you can't park any fire trucks where you really need to. <laughs> well, looks like my job here is done. See? Goodbye, everyone. He really isn't doing anything. Well, I, guess he can I guess they can prevent this from happening now. Well, yeah, but that doesn't help in this no instant. No people, yeah. <clears throat> they just well, it they up. just left? He's going to let those people... Oh, my God. Uh and I feel that like Cartman's crazy. mom left too, because yeah. none of them were there all of a sudden. Oh boy, did you hear about that fire downtown, Sharon? Oh my gosh, yes. They said like 14 people died. <gasps> oh. It's just ridiculous to me that they didn't build fire escapes on those upper floors. Ridiculous. Hey, you guys are just repeating what that hindsight guy said. I mean, he's right. right? Captain Hindsight is our protector and guardian. 
We're just thankful he was there for that fire. Now we can all eat in peace. What? You he didn't do peace? anything. Yeah, he didn't do nothing. Alert. What the hell is that? Alert, you guys. No. I feel um, Dad, I finished dinner. Can I go up to my room? Glitch. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, but I feel like Cartman just put them in, in every house, probably. You, you, you think they, you think they would have put it in Stan's bedroom? <laughs> exactly. They just left it but out they would he room. hear it from all the way down there? He's he's, supposed to be like he's a, tool a tool shed. man or yeah. something. Like that. Tool shed here, we can start. Yeah, tool shed. Who said you could put a big siren in my parents' house? See? Oh, you're right. I told you. So there's a big superhero out there doing stuff on his own, and he's not part of Cune and Friends. Oh, uh, Jesus. I've looked into it, and this Captain Hindsight is everywhere. <laughs> Fake computer. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Dallas. The Coon Cave. Dallas, could you let me out, please? Oh, yeah. Oh. He's just a, um, chaos. Yeah, but I don't know that he was. They held him yeah, captive. Yeah, Oh, Ew. man. You got poop, don't you? Who cares if a hero doesn't want to be part of Coon and Friends? I care! <laughs> Look, all we need to do is wait for the next disaster, then try to beat hindsight to the scene. It's funny. How you trying oh to be like God. Batman? Yeah, it is like Batman. You do think it's Kenny? I think that is Kenny. Oh, jeez. They're not supposed to be going through there. Oh, yeah, because it said a marine sanctuary. Oh no. They're gonna drill for oil in a marine yeah. sanctuary? It's not allowed. Uh -oh. Now there's gonna be an oil spill. Oh my god. Yep. Oh. Dang. All those. <laughs> it's so morbid because creatures. all the animals just automatically die. Yeah, instantly. Yeah. It's horrible. We can't stop the oil from contaminating everything. Our home is covered in sludge. Where are we supposed to go? Just look at all my scrap y'all. Just look at all my scrap y'all. We gotta trash all that. Bro. Yeah. Another oil spill can mean absolute devastation for the Gulf. We've got to help those people. Yes, this is definitely a job for Keenan fans. Let's pack the Gulf full of flavor. What made them come up with this? Were they trying to make fun of superheroes? It's almost like oh. kids in their imagination and just yeah. what they, like, you watch this stuff on TV so then they become their own superheroes. All right. You see where that rig is drilling? Yes. It's in too deep of water. They shouldn't have drilled in that deep of water because yeah. now they can't get machines deep enough to fix the spill. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> yes, yes! Then they should have had a backup safety valve to that backup safety oh valve. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, my God, he's right. Yep. My work here is done. <clears throat> I'm up oh, man. <laughs> Are they gonna all leave now like they did the last I disaster? Guess. He's still a worthless superhero, man. He doesn't like, do anything. Bro. I shouldn't say it's worthless. It's good to have the hindsight, but it's yeah. not helping in those situations. Yeah. Like in the immediate. He's giving hindsight after the fact. Yeah. The captain's very busy dealing with the Gulf oil crisis. I believe I have something that can help him deal with that oil crisis, sir. I feel like this makes him feel like Batman because I don't remember Superman ever being rich like that. No, he's not. Superman's like a journalist. I think he worked at a... Yeah, um, he is. They're mixing the two, really. News station. Captain Hindsight? Captain Hindsight, please come in. Go ahead. The oil keeps coming out. We've got other rigs now catching fire. Dude, Listen, we can't do nothing. They should have hosed down the other rigs as soon as the spill began. Then that wouldn't have happened. Right. Thank you. Why didn't you say that the first time? Yeah. <clears throat> Here's cleaned of oil. They're all dying. Get down to the volunteers and tell them they should have used a non-bleaching cleanser. Commissioner. <laughs> tell them what they should have did. So Bro, this done. not going to help them. Wrong. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> so guys what superhero is they trying to make fun of with mr hindsight hmm. i it... think it is mostly superman but it feels like yeah. a mix almost and if you refuse to be a part of that union you are a scab get this kid out of here i have to think <laughs> ben you will be hearing from my lo the coon's lawyer sir <laughs> the coon's lawyer coon coon's liar hello i'm tony haywood president and ceo of bp our accidental drilling spill again in the Gulf is a tragedy that should have never happened. You think? To all yeah. those affected, I want to say, we are deeply sorry. <laughs> We're sorry. I don't think that's going to help. Any oh, so you're going to show your... <laughs> what? say sorry in all, every We're scene. Sorry. And cooking and making cookies. <laughs> Skiing. Oh, that's, re sorry. that's really not helpful. P has taken full responsibility for cleaning up the spill in the Gulf. We're not going to do nothing about it, but we're going to tell you. We're sorry. This is like making fun of that big. Remember, BP did have that really big oil spill. How long? Ago and I was think that? that was in the Gulf. It was a while ago, probably ten years ago or something. Damn. And I have to look it up. It was a while ago. It could. It, it, could it was be a really big oil spill. Of, mm -hmm. I think it's a mix of stuff. 
All we need to do is get pictures of Captain Hindsight naked with Courtney Love. What? Oh my Why god. Why did he choose Courtney Love? Yeah. How do we get pictures of him naked with Courtney Love? <laughs> Professor Chaos up as Courtney Love. Take pictures of him naked with a homeless guy, then Photoshop Hindsight's face onto it. Why? Oh my gosh. And why do they have butters locked up? Yeah. I think we should help raise money for the relief aid by having a bank sale. We're superheroes, not the f***ing girl scouts. <laughs> <laughs> he said, bruh, we superheroes, man. From now on, we vote. Who wants to go with my plan? Yeah. Well, y'all uh -oh. vote department. I'll vote it. Uh-oh. Sounds awesome. Let's do it. To the grocery store. Do they even have money, though? Oh, well, no, I think he said his mom's lemon bars. Like, she was going to make the lemon bars. But they still got to go to And they're going to sell them at the grocery store, is what he said. So I knew I must act. The coon must know when to defend itself. Uh-oh. He's going to take him out. I oh, knew it. snap. So he's going to be like, go rogue and be on his own? Yeah, probably so. Oh, my gosh. That's okay, that's a little of... much. Bro, why y'all ain't stopping Cartman. it? Cartman. Bro. Oh, yeah. Like well, I'm sure they're fake, but they're still sharp enough. This time, the oil company they definitely has accidentally like ripped a hole that, uh, into uh, another. The BP situation you talked about. Yeah, because I remember it being a really bad and B. Into another dimension was there, but didn't think drilling into it would prove problematic. Oh my gosh. Now hundreds of creatures from another dimension oh are spilling out of our reality and wreaking havoc. Holy cow! I just took off that guy's head. I'm Whoa. Tony Hale, CEO of DP. So I'm guessing this guy really is the CEO of DP, probably. I think it probably, well, probably. Well, in this, they made it DP, but it was BP yeah. oil and... We're sorry. <laughs> we need to look up the interview when he actually apologized. Yeah, I'm curious. I'm trying to remember. Like, I'm sorry. I do feel like they could have taken more action faster to stop it, yeah. too, and they didn't. So I feel like this is making a lot of fun of that. Do you remember last week when I got really, really drunk? Yes, sir. Uh -oh. Look at those photos on the desk. <laughs> oh snap. They're actually making this work? Yeah. <laughs> but when did you have a I don't remember. That's just the point. I get drunk, I don't remember things. Alcohol shouldn't be legal. Oh, it's maddening. I can't believe they think those photos are real. Yeah. Where is Captain Hindsight? Where are you, Captain Hindsight? What's he gonna do anyways? Yeah. I don't wanna tell him. Tupperware, you tell him. I don't wanna tell him either. I'll tell him. Coon, I'm sorry, but we're kicking him out of Coon and Friends. Ah, <laughs> uh, I knew it. They get rid of that boy. But we get the headquarters and all the equipment. You don't keep anything. This is my basement. And yeah, they're in his house. We've already they are. This. That's true. Mrs. Cartman. Yes, Mysterion. Please escort the Coon out of our secret base. <laughs> <laughs> She's dragging that boy out. Mom, what the f your punishment is that your friends will just play superheroes without you. Oh. She's looking See, at it. They play superheroes. Well, superhero yeah, because yeah. wouldn't you? I mean, they're yeah. kids. You're, they're not really saving anybody. You're just figuring they're playing. We're sorry. Yeah. Apologize some As more. president of DP Oil, we're I sorry. want to say we're sorry. That's all they ever do? Yeah. I'm deeply sorry. <laughs> we're deeply. What? This boy naked. <laughs> Why is he naked <laughs> on that one? <laughs> oh, this oh bird carpet. The Kuhn friends have given in to evil. <laughs> it's up to the Kuhn to stop them. He looks like an evil superhero. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. The president of BP apologized. We're sorry. <laughs> but they drilled again and tore open a portal into another dimension. <laughs> I love how they went to the like. We're sorry. Not just an oil spill, but now a dimensional spill, basically. Yeah. But instead, Look at we don't care. care. We really don't care. That's so, how they make a point of that. Sorry. <laughs> and you got some wine I, and stuff. Yeah, it's like they're making Fireplace. it all sensual, and I don't understand why. Yeah. All will know who and what I truly am. Oh. So, Mysterion actually has a power. Mysterion, Mysterion rises. This is like Dark Knight yeah, Rises. Yeah, the Dark Knight Rises. Oh, gosh. Just terrific what you boys are doing. Thank you, ma'am. I'll take 20 lemon bars, you little rascals. 20. As America wonders what happened to Captain Hindsight, some Colorado kids are being a little superhuman themselves. <laughs> they call themselves Coon and Friends. Oh, this is going to make Cartman so mad. Oh, heck yeah. Their little super club consists of seven young heroes. Toolshed, the human kite. Mysterion. Kite. Tupperware. Mint. Very crunch. <laughs> Mixed very crunch. Yeah. I suppose they have Jimmy in it. <laughs> 
Unfortunately, we've just been informed that the Dark Lord Cthulhu has shed on the runway at the New Orleans airport and <laughs> will be delayed at least another hour. Oh, oh, oh Cartman's trying to so fly down there. We need to get to New Orleans now. But do you got money to even catch? Uh, well, I'm guessing you do because he had to go through security. I... Soon, I've heard of that. Yeah. I saw on TV that superhero group that's helping with the Gulf spill. Coon and friends. Do you know Mintberry Crunch? What's he like? <laughs> the one you hate the most. <laughs> the one he hates. Dang. Oh my God! You just beat up the little girl. The girl up. Oh gosh. The evil girl. They trying to make it sound she was evil. I like it. The kid was too much for her. As people look at her. Oh, I guess you're right. The they, 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 they the comic book thing for thing. him. Oh, man, it's crazy. I like they're imagining their now. own comics. Yeah. I'll take 10 lemon bars. That's definitely the last of them. You'll never stop him, you know. What the heck? That's just creepy. Yeah. The great one, Cthulhu. He has risen, and soon all will be under his rule. What the heck? The darkness of the mythos is finally here. <laughs> oh, man, these are really good lemon bars. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but it tastes brilliant. Oh, gosh. All right, superheroes, back to our secret base. Mint Berry Crunch. <laughs> Mixed Berry Crunch. What the hell? I knew it. Carbon what did he do? He just tore carbon, it all yeah, up. Yeah, he just destroyed everything down there. What do you mean, not carbon, dude? Whoever did this to our base was looking for something. Don't anybody move. What? Oh, gosh. They are the superheroes trying to blackmail me. Oh, dude, it's Captain Hindsight. Jack Brolin always had a knack for hindsight. Wanting to become the best known reporter oh, in the country. Oh, so that's Jack why he is a reporter. He'd have hindsight, hindsight so that's yeah. why he became Captain Hindsight. And then a freakish hindsight. accident occurred when a retroactive spider got into the equipment. Got there we go, the spider. spider. For months, he was able to use his new powers for good. So he was the combination of Superman and Spider-Man. <laughs> yeah, you're right. And Batman with the sense of, like, the rich yeah, lair and all the gadgets. Yeah. Um, dude, are you okay? Where are the pictures? Give every copy of the pictures to me now! Please, sir, we don't know what you mean. You got pictures of me having sex with Courtney Love. Do they not know that Courtney did it? It's not Courtney Love. <laughs> put down the gun. No. What if I put down the gun and then realize I shouldn't have? Look, dude, we don't need to play superhero anymore. We can just go home. Yeah, hey, bro, this hey, is all this right? serious. Right? Should've killed you all. Then do it. Dang. Pull the trigger, hindsight. If you Bruh. don't believe us, then you don't have a choice. Pull the trigger, you pussy. They're all like, dude, uh... Kenny, chill out. Yeah. My mom did tell me I had to be home by five. I, I said it's fine. Just go. I'm not sure who the kite is. <laughs> I don't know what's he gonna do when he gets up there. Because he's gonna try to get to this big old dark whatever it was again. This See? creature. Yeah, but I don't know what he's gonna do when he. Hey, continue. Stop. Yes, it is me, the Keen. <laughs> don't worry, I'm actually not here to fight you. What, he probably wants to befriend him? Probably. Perhaps we can work together. I knew it. Work together? Oh, I knew snap. it. <laughs> this boy, he just turned on everybody. He like, look me, y'all gonna kick me out? All right, I got some for y'all. I'm gonna team up with this creature. But there's a group of superhumans who are going to stop at nothing to stop you. <sighs> Carmen is the worst, man. The worst friend ever. What? He's not even considered a friend, really. Uh. Good, I have your attention. They reside in Colorado, and they are f***ing toes and... <laughs> He's trying to get, he's trying to get so revenge he's gonna on use them they kicked him out of the group. Huge creature to take out his friends because yeah. he's mad. Do you have any idea what a curse it is to have perfect 2020 hindsight? <laughs> Soon as something bad happens, I immediately know how it could have been avoided. Without you, they feel helpless and stupid. Well, I don't want the power anymore, all right? What, what is your power? I can't die. What? Yeah, cause Kenny Cause always Kenny comes back. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, he, he does have a super yeah. superhero power. No matter what, I wake up in my bed wearing my same old clothes. And the worst part, nobody even remembers me dying. I go to school the next day, and everyone is just like, "Oh, hey, Kenny." <clears throat> even if they had seen me get decapitated with their own eyes. It kind of makes you wonder: Does Kenny actually die, or is that really in his like in his head that he's dying? Oh, I see what you're saying. You I never thought about that. But, right? Like you know, he's imagining it yeah. or something. That's why he's never because actually gone. You always had Stan. Like they kill Kenny, and then Kyle would be like, "You bastard!" So they yeah. definitely know. But the next day, it's like nobody will remember him dying. You're right. But it so, almost seems like is it an imagination? Or yeah, something. is it really an imagination? I never thought about it that way. Tragic spill in the Gulf is a disaster that should have never happened. 
And as head of the oil company responsible, I would like to say, what should I do? Should I admit we've made mistakes? Should I find newer and better ways to say I'm sorry? <laughs> no. Sorry. Oh my gosh. Make changes, maybe? <clears throat> I do. What should I do? What should I do? Should I forget about the past and not care about my powers? What should I do? Should I accept my role as the villain? Maybe I should just disappear. Should I admit I was wrong? <laughs> Ask for everyone's forgiveness. Everybody just talking to themselves. Story. Yeah, it's like, um... Nah, screw that. I'm just gonna keep being a fucking dick. So I wouldn't expect Cartman to do that. It's like a, I don't know, like a piece when you're everyone's self-reflecting. Yeah, it's self -reflecting. like a movie or it's, something. It's kind of connecting up with each other. Mm -hmm. Ten arrested in South Park for cultish activity. This is from like ten years ago. So these people have been waiting for Cthulhu a long time. Hey, wait a minute. Dude, Mysterion, it's your parent. No way. <laughs> They're part of the call. Yeah, they got arrested. That would be the perfect time to take it out if it's sleeping, you would think. Yeah, but how are you going to take it out? I don't know. Get a drop of bomb on it. Yeah. You're a sleepy man, ne? Got your lip? This is how he's trying to befriend him. Yeah. He's lulling him back to sleep. <clears throat> <It's looking laughs> <blunt. laughs> yeah. You're hogging it all, asshole. <coughs> Cause I paid for it, you stupid Dang. <gasps> oh god, he's back! It's that mystery kid again! <laughs> what the hell do you want this time? Yeah. We treat our kids better and we don't beat each other up as much. Damn, not as much. Yeah. It is really good. Yeah, burning burn, burn down your house. Oh. Uh, so now what? Ten years ago, you were arrested for being in some kind of cult. We were? We've been arrested lots of times. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> I swear we haven't been back to their meetings ever since, even though we always still get invited. And he's, and he's gone. gone. <laughs> Did that really just happen? I don't think so. <laughs> you don't think so, <laughs> Do they think bruh? they're hallucinating from the weed, I guess? Yeah, I guess so. They must be already high. No, no. We intend to bring change and fight injustice as the all-new Coon and Friends. And anybody else using that name for their benefit is breaking the law. <laughs> How did he oh, get all gosh. these people here? You know what I'm saying? I don't to know. even give this speech. I guess because they said Cthulhu was holding a press conference? Yeah. I don't know. Hello, Imavna. What the heck? This is the call. The call yeah. They were trying to go to the meeting, remember? Well, Mysterion's trying to go. There must be clubs like this all over the world. We know some of these people. There's Mr. Adler from Shop Class and those two geeky computer guys. Hmm? Oh my god, look! Back row. Aren't those the goth kids? Oh. <laughs> this one, how they always do it there here. Like, yeah, he goes. Yeah. And with strange aeons, even death may die. What does that mean, human kite? I'm not sure, tool shit. Could it be a riddle, Mysterion? M Mysterion? Oh, he disappeared. Yeah. Because he was just there with him. Just like Batman. Mm, that is him? true. I see him being yeah. gone. Where are you, Captain Hindsight? No! <laughs> what the heck? Perhaps he had a big old cut. Cut the old, yeah. Oh. No. He's on the roof. <laughs> Who the F and H is that? What does it mean? That is not dead, which can eternal lie. Well, he don't fear death because he dies when he's out. Yeah. <clears throat> That's why he feels like he has a superpower. Yeah. Nobody's stopping Cthulhu now. <laughs> All will be sadness. Life will become death. And I will watch the crimson blood. Ooh, Dang. Wow. It's like a baby saying this, yeah. practically. The child is right, you know. Cthulhu sees all, hears all. The Dark Lord wants us to dispense of this one, kids. Give us a hand. Dang. I don't want to kill anybody. <laughs> yeah, hey, I don't want to take Yeah, they're like, I'm not that into yeah. this. Okay, so are they going to actually take Kenny out, but then he comes guessing, back? Yeah. So what is their reason for always, like, taking Kenny out and bringing him back? You know what I'm saying? Is it like a joke? You know, I feel like it is. Part? It's just kind of funny because you know it's just Kenny always dies now. I guess when they first took him out, you know, a lot of people mm -hmm. liked him as a character and they decided to bring him back. That and could I guess be a good point. I guess they made and then a joke out of it. And then it just made a joke out of it. Yeah. Filled Cthulhu from one dimension far away Flying through gates of madness oh and into your heart 
Aww. But now they became friends. Yeah. I wonder if that's almost <laughs> kind of like never ending story or something. Yeah, kind of is. Yeah. <laughs> And of Batman. course, Cartman's happy to be evil. They got the Dark Knight Rises. They got the BP situation. Mm-hmm. They got that movie. Never any story. story. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Dang, they're taking over like the whole country. Yeah. They're just destroying it. Just hold still and it will be over quickly. Mosquito. <laughs> Humankite. See, I think humankite is Kyle. Courage. Yeah. Let him go, mm-hmm. dude, or else we'll totally tell our parents on you. We won't tell our parents on you. <laughs> they don't even care. <gasps> oh my god, they, they killed Kitty! <laughs> you bastard! <laughs> Here we go. He wakes up in his bed. Kitty, what'd you run away for? We gotta fight these guys. See? <laughs> Like they like took the idea from Captain Crunch. It like is the berries. Captain Crunch, but the berries what? That's like why do you make it mint berry? Berry. Yeah. He realized he had superpowers he could call upon by turning in place and saying the magic word. Shamagoo! And in a flash, Bradley is transformed into that thrilling superhero, Mint Berry Crunch. Um, he, he, berry got like, he is like a sucky superhero. I mean, but I know Carmen was giving him a lot of crap for a that. A lot of it. Because it's like, how can a berry be a like half berry, half human? Dude, I'm sorry, but we still aren't getting it. You're half man and half berry? Right! But then what exactly is your superpower? The power of mint and berries, yet with a satisfying, tasty crunch. So I wonder what, like, milk make them more stronger or whatever. Yeah, maybe. Like, I have mental command over all power tools. Human kite can fly and shoot lasers out of my eyes and shoot lasers out of his eyes. And Mysterion can... Wait, what's your superpower, Mysterion? He can't die. I can't die. <laughs> oh, yeah, good one. Mysterion can't die. <laughs> I feel like Crunch, because his name is Crunch, he could be strong. Uh, I could kind of see that, because his name is Crunch. He could be like almost like I mean, the Hulk he, in a way. He can crush things. Right. I guess. I could kind of see that. Yeah. That's what he should say, but he's not saying anything. Yeah, yeah I guess you could do that. I mean, yeah. yeah, I can crush things. Yeah. Like last night in the alley, the cult leader stabbed me and oh, I bled all over the place. And you screamed, oh my God, and you called him a bastard. When was that? Yeah. And they don't remember it, it, it already. Really, in, his, in his imagination. And it's exactly what Kenny said. Nobody ever remembers. I think we would remember you dying, dude. <laughs> well, you don't. I die over and over. Only to wake up in my bed like nothing happened. Dude, you're freaking out Mintberry Crunch. He's peed his pants. <laughs> no, no. Mint Actually, he did. He pissed himself. Pee his pants. Oh, my gosh, he did. All right, dude. Let, let's just say you're not crazy and it's true. What's the big deal? I mean, I think it'd be pretty cool not to be able to die. Pretty cool? Do you know what it feels like to be stabbed, to be shot, yeah, to over. Dang, that is true. He's yeah, got everything painful. probably done to him. It f***ing hurts. I bet. And it won't go away, and nobody will believe me. Try and f***ing remember. <gasps> oh, my God. Holy shit, dude. You. Is he? Oh, Jesus. Dang, that was like, I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting no, that either. No, that was... Yeah. But on all the times that Kenny died, you think he'd have a higher tolerance of pain? He since might. he got ran over, he yeah, got stabbed, he got mean, shot, yeah. and all this other stuff. But That's a good hey, question. Hey. Seeing the disaster on Kuhn Vision, the Kuhn immediately called together his trusty Kuhn friends. <laughs> As the Kuhn explained how the disaster could be stopped, something terrible happened. Without warning, the Kuhn friends changed. Their superpowers morphed somehow. Turned them into <laughs> He's making them all evil. Those bad guys. <laughs> tried to bring them back to the side of good. The Kuhn teamed up with Cthulhu. Because even Cthulhu knows what evil assholes Kyle and Stan and those guys are. And that they are manipulative, uncaring, vagina phasing. <laughs> With Cthulhu's help, I can try to banish them to a dark oblivion for all eternity. <laughs> I will not rest until that happens. Well, you know, so, it, it, it's, it's all about perspective, right? It is. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, we, we are the ones to decide who's the good guys and who's the bad guys. And from Carmen's perspective, they are the bad guys. They turned on him. They kicked him out of his own house. It's so it's like he's the good guy. But They're bad. That's because he was being the one that was like almost evil. And yeah. then now he doesn't seem to see the fact that he's like destroying everywhere they go just to get to his friends. Yeah. So yeah. that's not good. Nope. So he's all of a sudden back home. Yeah. Eric Cartman. Hi, man. 
Where have you been, young man? Yeah, you like you haven't been mom. freaking out. Are my friends out? downstairs in the secret base? Yes, they are, but you were supposed to be grounded in your room. Go away, Cartman. We kicked you out of Coon and Friends, remember? No, I, I know. That's cool. I understand. Even though I started it in the secret bases in my house. Yeah, no, that's totally understandable. <laughs> <laughs> There's a double rainbow outside. Oh, uh, no. What? Double rainbow, He's you He's trying to get them outside so that the two can right take them out. You yeah. gotta come see. Hey, can I see the double rainbow, fellas? Got, they still got I can't believe poor Butters is locked up. It. Like, where's his parents? He makes him look almost ridiculous. Like ridiculous. He's going to help me get rid of you guys, so together we can make the world a better place. Carmen, if you team up with the most evil thing in the universe, then clearly you are the bad guy. Yeah. I was gonna say, clearly yeah, you're much. evil. Superman teamed up with Lex Luthor. Superman never teamed up with Lex Luthor. <laughs> well, that's why Superman isn't around anymore, isn't it? Vanish <laughs> uh, <laughs> them to a dark oblivion, please. Oh man. Actually, you didn't even out of here. Oh, oh my god, he actually did. They just disappeared. I think Dude, Mysterion awesome. maybe wasn't that in that though. Somebody ran off first. Pretty soon the whole world will be transformed thanks to the king. I feel Whatever. like he's getting bored. Yes, yeah, he's yes, getting bored of Quadrant. Uh oh. Yeah, he's going to turn on Quadrant. Yep. He's about to. The kid will have to use an even more manipulative technique. Time to bust out cute kitten. So he's trying to act like he's a kid. Yeah, I guess. Meow, meow, meow. <laughs> He's needing him like a cat. Well, that's how I beat some cats. They dig their claws into you. Like, ah, ah. <laughs> so they're gonna be. Dude, I used to say they're gonna be a different we? universe now, or yeah. a multiverse. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, but oh no, Mysterion was with like them. I... Captain, the Crunchberry ran off. The coon had returned with the Dark Lord Cthulhu. Upon seeing Cthulhu in person, Midberry Crunch heroically dashed off. <laughs> Heroically dashed yeah. off or ran out of fright. With minty coolness, he hurried back home and heroically watched Judge Judy. <laughs> Not <that> Judge Judy. <laughs> <laughs> <Bruh>. <laughs> oh. oh, that fucking hurt. I bet, oh, bro. I see what he's doing though. He killed himself because he'll wake up in his bed. Yeah. Oh my god, you, you crazy bastard. <laughs> if you think about it, it is funny because he did just shoot himself at the beginning of this episode and they already yeah. don't remember that. Poor Kenny, he's just constantly going through this cycle. Yeah. His parents don't really give a care, like whatever. No, it doesn't seem like they pay much attention to what he's doing, honestly. Nah. It's burning, man! Biggest party in the world! It's a big, baby. like, festival concert, live concert. For yeah. Movie. They have a blast. Oh, yeah. Is just gonna have yeah, he said his next thing everybody. on his list was take out Burning Man. I don't know why, but that's what he wanted to do. The dark and evil Cthulhu is bringing <laughs> just imagine, like, a lot of the party just there, just reporting right. everything. Like, bro, you better get out of there. Excuse me, it is not Cthulhu, it is Kuhn and Fran. I'm a little sick of everyone giving him all the credit when I'm the one really making the world a better place. <laughs> Tom, it appears that Bruce Valanche has arrived on the scene wearing a rat costume. Oh, you mother... <laughs> Said a rat, rat costume. Oh, damn! Oh. I'll get that fire twirling hippie. Damn! How do I fight him? Oh, that's oh, right. Joy. It's underwear boy again. <laughs> underwear boy. Henrietta, your little brother wants to play with you. Go away, mom. I hate you. Now look at her. Just let your little She's not even questioning friends, nothing. Okay, uh -uh. kids, you know. Go on in, my kids, I don't really care if they're in the cold. Well, you guys paid with me? Dork, I don't want you here. Mysterion, what's I going on? I say this meant very crunch. That's okay, yeah. sis. I'll play with you another time. Now he's leaving. Yeah. Time for Bradley Bagel to transform. Shablagoo! <laughs> he just circles <laughs> Shablagoo. That is crazy, boy. Kiss the mm. imagination. I know, it cracks me up. That's it. That's the place I just was. You've been to the nightmare city of Ralia? Lucky. <laughs> lucky. <laughs> lucky. The only thing that can destroy an immortal is another immortal. Oh, him. Because he technically can't die. You don't understand. How was it that Mint and Mary came together delivering full flavor and an intense grudge? We must find out <laughs> answers, like, Mysterion. Well, he just left. But Mysterion, <laughs> I'm going with you. They would come up against their most challenging and most oh, evil no. opponents. Oh, no. Justin Bieber. 
Justin <laughs> Bieber. This little butthole had to be stopped. Are you, you kidding? Stop. Can you grab me a piece? And so it looks like he just... <laughs> He literally oh, breaks in and just takes out Justin Bieber, though. Yep, that's him. So long, Justin Bieber, you little douchebag. So what's he grabbing his keys, man? Back oh, in the oh. dang. He's that was graphic. Yeah. <laughs> I have to know what I am. Come back. <laughs> Come back, you fat piece of sh Your true name is Gok Zara. Gok Zara? The power given to you comes from a planet far away. You are from that planet, Gox. So that's like a Superman kind of thing. I know you must sometimes see this power as a curse. You must now harness and focus your power, Goxara. The power of mint and berries, yet with a tasty, satisfying crunch. What? So, so he's he going to harvest berry. his power? Yeah. Your home planet, Kokujon, is known throughout the universe for its berry mines. What? <laughs> <laughs> berry mines? Mines. Your mother and I sent you as far away as we could. Use your power, son. Save Earth. Shablagu. <laughs> oh my gosh. Run. No more running away for Mint Berry Crunch. You're making it like he's actually a real superhero. Yeah. That's what's going to be the best part is that he's the really the only he's superhero. Hello, Cthulhu. I heard you haven't been. Yeah, he's actually Barry. a real superhero. Yeah, he's, like, he's the one who actually has powers. <laughs> what? <laughs> So that's the reason why we don't ever see him in South Park because he's not like one of the like yeah. the regular like tasks. So he's actually not. from a different planet. Different. Still alive. I returned them to their world encased in a protective berry bubble. Then it's back down to seal up the hole protective created by the BP oil company. Returning home only momentarily to flip off my fat sister. <laughs> Dang. Dude, thanks for getting us out of that dark oblivion, Midberry Crunch. No, no. We worked as a team. All the Coon and friends stopped the BP drilling spill crisis. And finally, the evil Coon is right where he belongs. <laughs> but poor Butters is still yeah, in there. Like, you ain't gonna let Butters out. Fine. This is inhumane. There's a big bucket with Butters poop in here, and there's nothing to eat. <laughs> you got poop, don't you? Well, I bought. See, so you want the boy to poop. Well, that's what he told Butters, so. Happened to my parents. Well, come back and visit any time, dude. I will. Shabla-goo! <laughs> <laughs> He's actually a real <laughs> superhero. <laughs> Mintberry can crunch. I should have called it wow, too. It yeah, yeah. Bradley actually had superpowers. <laughs> I'm tired, guys. Think I'm gonna go to bed. <gasps> wow. Oh my god! Holy shit, dude! Kenny! No! No! <laughs> what? What? It's happening again! No way, so he she has him every time. Yeah. How the hell do he grow that fast? That's a good question. It'd be painful for her every time her right? son dies. She gives birth to him. Should have never gone to that stupid cult meeting. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess uh, that's it. So he's supposed to be like just keeps reincarnating because yeah, coming back. They had gone to that. Oh, that's hilarious. They had worshipped Cthulhu or something. Yeah, so that's the reason why Kenny like is immortal because yeah. his parents oh was in a gosh. cult, and her curse is every time her son dies, she gets she pregnant and have him right away. Him again. Oh my god, that'd that's be painful. insane. Boy. <laughs> But yeah, Too guys, funny. this was a funny, funny trilogy. We it definitely enjoyed good. it, man. Mm -hmm. Comment down below, man, what trilogy you want us to check out next. Yep. It's your man, Boy B. And Nicole. I'm going to catch you on the next time. Awesome. Peace and love, baby.